Okay, I thought it would be easier to make a video about this rather than um, trying to explain it via uh, messages. Basically, this is going to be your wet stick. This is going to be your fruiting wet stick. And the first question that you had for me was why can't I have a top cutting fruiting wet stick? And the reason is right now, all of the fruiting monsteras are fruiting. That's what that is. If you look around your house, all of your aeroids are producing flowers right now. Monsteras do the same thing. This right now, are, those are the flowers, and those flowers are going to open up and you'll see the fruit that's inside of them. The flowers turn into fruit. And so that's the process that's happening right now. That is the top of the vine. So you said, well, okay, I want, I want to have that. Um, why can't I have that? The reason is because this wet stick is going to prioritize rooting and um, uh, pushing out growth from its nodes it's not going since there is no leaf there is no top leaf the growth is going to start coming out from the nodes so this um, wet stick is going to prioritize doing that and not prioritize uh, maturing this fruit so you will no longer have a top cutting this fruit is going to rot off the the main purpose that this uh, wet stick is concerned with now is survival. It's not concerned with producing fruit that it can't even support. So though this whole um, section of fruit is going to rot off. So that's why you can't have a top cutting right now. Right now, the growth is going to come from the nodes. Um, there are little growth points on each node. Let me just show you where yours are. There is one right there. That is a growth point. That is going to produce some. And then if you look over on the next side, you can't really see because um, these uh, stems are in the way. These stems are gonna rot off, by the way. But these stems are in the way, but you'll see on each one of these nodes, there will be a little um, oval-shaped growth point, and that's where the growth is going to come from. Um, you can see it more clearly on this wet stick. You can see right there, and that is because all of the um, leaves have uh, uh, been uh, taken off of them. But anyways, you can see right there, there's a growth point. And I'm sure if you rock it this way, you can see more growth points bulging out right there. This one actually turned into a vine. If it's connected to the mother vine, it will the growth point will be huge. But since there, um, since this is severed from the mother vine, the growth points are uh, the growth from these growth points is going to be small, like this. Here are, here is, this has been severed. There's a little growth point right there. Notice how there's no roots. It's just uh, sucking all the energy out of this wet stick. Um, here's another one right here. There's no roots. This is just sitting here. This was just sitting on top of a pot. This is one that I'm chronicling for the series. I promise that I'm going to do the wet stick series. I am working on it, but you can see there's a growth point. There's a growth coming from it right now. You just want to give it some medium for that growth point to root into. But anyways, that's another story. But anyways, back to the fruiting wet sticks. Um, so your um, fruit, the top of this vine is fruit. So the top of the vine is going to to rot off this this fruit is going to rot off so that's why we just go ahead and cut this node and just send you this part but um, I will send you the whole thing so that you can you know kind of admire it and whatnot <laughs> and see the whole process for yourself but um, yeah eventually you're going to have to cut off that fruit now your next question was what happens in between the fruit are there leaves in between the fruit and the answer is yes um, um, this is a perfect example of one um, these the fruit comes on these little stems you see this little stem right here well when the um, uh, fruit it falls off of them these little stems rot like this so you can see here here 
here this these this is where it fruited last time sorry I got a bit too long-winded and the camera cut me off <laughs> okay so anyway um, the you can see here this is what growth from the nodes look like the growth from the growth point um, so you have growth points on your wet stick and they will cut they will bulge out and they will protrude and then you will have the new growth that comes from them if this were still connected to the mother vine this is what the new growth would look like it would be huge like this and that's what a lot of people show when they're ads <laughs> but since this is cut off from the mother vine the growth points are going to look somewhat like this so anyways um, the next question that you had for me was what happens in between the fruiting and this wet stick is the perfect example of what happens so right now it is fruiting all of the monsteras that are fruiting monsteras are fruiting and you'll see the stem right here that's where um, the fruit uh, uh, is uh, protruding from so if you look down here you'll see these that's what these are these are the old stems from last year and here's a little depression basically these eventually will just rot off but I'm gonna cut them off before sending them but anyways these are little depressions right here uh, that if you see the little depressions right there you'll know that it has rooted before so anyway, there's a plane passing. <laughs> so anyway, um, what happens in between fruiting? What happens in between fruiting is just what happens with every other Monstera. You're just going to have regular leaf, a regular leaf, a regular leaf, 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 and then here was the last fruiting cycle. You'll see right here, these are the stems, the telltale stems, but normally you'll just see little depressions, and that's where the stems used to be. This one is um, very prolific fruiter you can see all the little fruits that came off of there and then it goes right back to leaf 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 so it just goes leaf fruit leaf fruit and it just goes on forever like that and yes all of your nodes all of the the growth points all of these little monsteras that come from your wet stick will all have the DNA and the growth memory to produce fruit so all of the ones from this one all of the ones from this one nobody knows why some produce fruit but most of them don't but um, yours will produce fruit